Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to Let's Play The Long Dark. My name is Weasel and we are- come on, close. And we are at the Abandoned Outpost. Ow. What is that wolf running after? Uh, I actually wanted to get, you know, walk into that direction, but there are so many wolves. So many wolves! Um... Yeah, it's still the plan. I'm gonna, gonna go this direction. I'm pretty much just hanging out uh, on the coastal highway now. Not doing too well in terms- uh, not uh, doing actually really well in terms of uh, my state. I'm 100%, I got warm clothing, I have a little bit of food left. Oh, the carcass is still there. Didn't I loot everything? And, uh, yeah. Well, that's oh, hey buddy! Um... Not taking any risks here. Screw that noise. Guess who's gonna eat wolf? <laughs> yes, it's me. Okay, uh, give me all that meat. Getting ready to hit that cancel button in case something black appears on the horizon. Nope, we're good. Give me that height. And I'm encumbered. Way too much wolf meat right now. Um, give me the gut. I guess it wouldn't be the worst idea to head for Quonset gas station. Uh, to t take care of this. Uh, oh, have oh, it's also foggy. So guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna head back to the abandoned outpost. Wow, yes, lots of progress here, right, right there. I'm gonna head to the abandoned outpost. And da -da 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 -da. I'm gonna cook my wolf. The good thing is about this foggy weather, I can still harvest wood. So even though I can't really go out and explore, I can still, you know, harvest wood without, you know, endangering myself. Even though it's cold. Well, actually, it feels like two degrees. I'm gonna forge uh, two hardwoods. 12% uh, hatchet. Ooh, no good. No good. I don't like where this is going. I hope I have another hatchet in Quonset gas station. Seems like this is where I'm gonna head next to find the ha another hatchet, and if not, I'm gonna have to repair it because I'm gonna have a problem otherwise. Uh, my hatchet is at 11%. I don't like that at all. All right, let's quickly cook up the wolf meat. Um, where is that? There's my fire starter. Uh, 89%. I'm 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 done with that. And yeah, I'm gonna quickly cook up the wolf meat. Alright, so I cooked myself up the wolf meat, I bought myself some water, uh, two more liters with the remaining I had, and I'm actually going to put um, a liter for now in here, uh, not too much. The sardines, you know what, I'm going to, uh, that, that makes no sense to eat this by the way, I wish I could just throw it away, guess I'm just gonna keep it. Um, yeah, this all goes down, this is probably gonna disappear eventually. And uh, yeah, we're going to head to Quonset gas station, at least that is my plan. I'm gonna go for a hatchet. Let's drink something first. I'm not even gonna attempt to go when I go down this thing to the left, because it's full of wolves. That's, you know, <laughs> I got my uh, recent kill here. Okay. Oh, that's not a whole kilogram, it's just a little bit remaining. Mm. Yeah, that's, that's the older one, let's eat that first. I'm gonna waste calories here. I'm still encumbered. I guess... Is there something I could leave here? Um, I guess I'm just gonna leave another liter of water. Two liters, that's fine. And I'm gonna take this with me. I'm gonna... F uh, 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 still store it in the Quonset gas station. Up here it makes no sense. And let's hit that ne uh, head there now to repair my hatchet or look for another hatchet. Also, let's reload the magazine. 10 bullets. 29 bullets. I'm hearing a weird noise. Is that a wolf? Walking around or something like that? Oh, it's a wolf. There he is. Hey, buddy. Oh, this is just friggin' fantastic. That is just lovely. Hey, hey, you. I don't think he's gonna walk up the stairs. I don't think he sees me. Not that I'm gonna risk it though. Okay, he has no eye contact, I think. Ah! That is a weird situation right there. What time is it? It's 3.25. Um, 
I'm probably gonna make a big mistake, but I'm just gonna walk this way. I don't wanna stay another hour in that stupid outpost. Yeah, we're good. We're good. He didn't see me there. Just have to make sure that I don't oh, fall too badly down here. Uh, not, nope, nope. And I fell. But, no damage. <laughs> so pro. So pro. Give me that, give me that. Whew. Everything's good. No worries. We are going to survive. Luckily, they don't usually roam the mountains. So I'm just taking the really obscure path here. Uh, I'll take a steep hill over a wolf anytime, any day. And we're... Ooh, look what we found. We found a little hut. We are on the middle path or whatever it is. Ooh, we found several huts. Actually, that's really cool. Only problem is I don't really have a whole ton of uh, free space to carry. Oh, and we found a corpse. I'm surprised that there are no wolves here. Oh, a pry bar. That is most... That is amazing. Uh, definitely carrying around too much. I'm just gonna take it off the ground. Can always uh, carry it in here. Uh, we're gonna quickly check the houses. Or cabins. Okay, for firewood, nothing on the bed. Something in here, nope. Nothing on the shelf. Something in here, doesn't look like it. Well, pork some beans and pinnacle, pe pinnacle peaches and a backpack. With nothing inside it, what a shame. Well, you can't always have luck here. Let's check the other two houses. Mm. I'm not gonna be encumbered anymore as soon as I hit and uh, eat another uh, meat. How much calories do I have? One seven. Yeah, I could eat just another kilogram of meat. I'm eating like a horse, just like a damn horse. Hey you! Ah, did someone freeze to death? Obviously he did, Weasel. Obviously he did. I bet he didn't have a stroke. I could use this. Yes, I could. Um, down vest, yes, very good, more cloth for the weasel. I don't see anything in here, I searched for that, nothing under the bed. We're good, next hut. Uh, last one remaining, third one's the charm. Um, wait, wait, that was the third one, wasn't it? Yeah, I think I looked in this one. Or not? God, my brain is really not doing what it's supposed to do. You know? Nope, wasn't in here. Very good that I checked. Um, yeah. Tomato soup. It's a glorious day for tomato soup. I need to use my light. Is there something back? Oh no, that's just the leg of the bed. Uh, yeah, they they can be tricky. There is. Nothing in these boxes. Uh, look for everything. We're good. We're good. Okay, what time is it? It's 4 p.m. I am going to eat a delicious kilogram of wolf meat. Mm -hmm. Drink some water and that should get us out of the encumbered zone. Hopefully. Or not. I could just leave the pry bar behind, honestly. Uh, the pry bar weighs a kilogram. How much? Let's quickly compare scrap metal that weighs 200 grams. So I'm going to harvest the pry bar, the 52% pry bar. And maybe the other clothing items as well. Um, like the toque, because currently I'm wearing one, 73. Oh, actually, yeah, we have toe toques. I should harvest both of them. Mm. Good. We are in such an amazing shape right now. All that cloth. We can repair our stuff for so long. You know what? I wouldn't even be surprised if I could make 50 days. I mean, now I'm jinxing it, obviously. I'm probably gonna run into a wolf as soon as I exit this place. Um, but 
That would be so amazing. Uh, cotton long underwear. I actually have a better one with me, so I'm gonna switch those out. Uh, that is at 78. This is only at 6, so I'm gonna re uh, not repair. I'm gonna harvest that. One that I'm not wearing, the underwear. Uh, where is it? Cotton long underwear. Sorry, harvesting that stuff here. So we're not encumbered anymore. And yes, we are only wearing 29 out of 30. Carrying, not wearing. You're not wearing weight weasel. And it's 5, uh, it's 6 p.m. Mm. Mm. Am I gonna stay in the hut or am I gonna keep going? I'm gonna keep going. I feel super cocky. Ooh, yeah, we good. Don't break yourself. Don't break a leg, weasel. I know that's a thing that people wish on you. You know, like, hey, break a leg. Or is it don't break? It's it's break a leg, I think. I don't know why people would wish that on you. It's a weird idiom. A really weird one. Honestly. It's the same, like, knock on wood. Big question is, though, is that a German one that I think is also an English one? I don't know. God, I really bring, I have a problem with confusing my idioms. Uh, I have a few German um, <laughs> uh, ones that I love to translate. That's 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 a common joke in Germany if we translate our idioms uh, into English. Um, that makes the dog uh, crazy in the pan. Da wird doch der Hund in der Pfanne verrückt. I think I translated that one properly. That's a thing we say. Or we say... I get dogs, or I get young dogs. I get puppies, yes. That when something is annoying you. Krisch Hunde, or Krisch, Krisch Welpen. At, le at least I knew someone who said that. Really weird stuff. Do you have some favorite idioms? I could, I could, I could try to translate them <laughs> into German. Which would help no one. Like, seriously, no one. Uh, okay. We also have a, a really weird way to insult people by, you know, saying something like, you warm showerer. You know, someone who takes warm showers. That is how we insult people. Oh, hey, buddy. Um. Uh, what to do, 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 what to do. Killing him. He's so close to the Quonset gas station that I just need it. You don't understand, I need this. 3.6 kilogram delicious wolf meat. Should, should quickly make sure that there's no one around me right now. Even if there were wolves around me, they would be scared off. Um, give me that hide. Ah, it's gonna friggin' kill my hatchet, isn't it? 9% hatchet, okay. That is definitely a thing I'm having, uh, I have to do. I'm going to have to record that hatchet. <laughs> record that hatchet. Uh, repair that hatchet. Okay, 9.3 kilograms of meat. That is... Wow. A lot of meat. Okay. Um, quick change of plans. We are going to spare the hatchet. I'm going to quickly grab the hunting rifle, uh, hunting knife. For that, I should have that in that one drawer. I left it behind. Let's quickly check. Uh, wait... Hunting knife. No, no, not in here. Um, not in here. Where did I, I put it somewhere in here. Pretty sure. Or is it in the workbench? Wait. Tools. Hunting rifle. Hatchet. Oh, please don't tell me that I have no hunting knife. Um. Yeah, tool. Nothing in here. Nothing in here. There's only food in here as much as, as far as I can see. Uh, simple tools, that's great. I would really like to take all that meat with me. Pry bar, simple tools. Well, I don't even have the hunting knife with me. I think I took only the hatchet. To repair a hatchet, we do need fur firewood, so we're gonna have to harvest that. Okay, we're going to harvest firewood now. I'm gonna go outside. Gonna grab ah that's hardwood, right? Fur firewood is hardwood. Hopefully there's no wolf and hopefully the, the 
I mean, the deer should be there tomorrow. I'm gonna harvest six units of hardwood. I'm gonna take an hour. Yeah, that should be fine. That should work out somehow. Oh, I broke the hatchet. I am an idiot. <laughs> oh, this is not good, guys. Oh, this is not good. This is absolutely horrible. I do need something like a knife or a hatchet. Um, uh, no good, no good. Well, that is how you get yourself into a really sticky situation. Um, for now, we are okay, but this is gonna, you know, cause a lot of problems now. For firewood, I'm gonna use three of them, or, yeah, three. Um, yeah, use an accelerant, fine. Cool with me. I really like the fire striker anyway. Uh, okay. Let's cook us some wolf meat. And we're gonna need um, to find another one of these. I think I have one at the Trapper's Homestead. That's where we have the hunting knife. Ah, uh, I broke my hatchet. That is probably the thing that's, you know, going to kill me. I mean, I can still harvest wood. The problem is I can't um, harvest meat without a hunting knife or a hatchet. So to keep that food source going, we're going to have to do something about it. Um, for firewood, yes, neat. Okay, let's eat something and drink something. You know, five more liters so there's no need to cook. Ah, I could just as well boil up something. I still have like an hour going, so. Uh, two liters of water, always good. You can do that within an hour, I think. Or a little bit more than an hour. Just takes 45 minutes, and boiling that water takes roughly, oh, actually 30 minutes. Or 20 minutes. Eh, more or less an hour. Okay. Equipment. We're carrying around way too much stuff, which is all right. Okay. There's no need to worry at all. Uh, I'm just gonna eat my wolf meat. I'm gonna sleep a few hours until it's day again. Where's, where's the bed? There's the bed. I'm gonna sleep until it's six. Six relaxing hours and then we're gonna think what to do about the whole situation. I think I wanna head back and get a hunting knife. Or look for other places with hunting knives. I thought I had one with me, but I left it behind at the Trapper's Homestead. Because, oh well, I only need the hatchet and if it breaks I can repair it. Smart weasel. Our best bet is to head back to actually get the hunting knife. In any case, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thanks for watching. I'm Weasel. I'm out. And I hope to see you around. Bye bye. Yeah, it was like a JPEG. Look at that quality <laughs> animation there. <laughs> that animator spent, I don't know, moments on this. <laughs> Several seconds. At least. Like, I don't understand how... At the time the N64 came out, the shit looked so amazing. And Mario 64 looked amazing. I was so blown away when that Super, thing came out. Super Mario 64 was actually the first Nintendo 64 game I ever saw. That and was mind blowing. My dad had a rich friend, and his son was, you know, had all the cool things. Of course. And at the time, he had to be rich for this. <laughs> when you think about it, it's that's, like that's true. way to go, humanity.